guys and welcome it is that SRE2 dude here today look at me slowly rotate while lightly pushing the analog stick but yes finally Splatoon is here I am finally I can't believe it it's it's so surreal to actually finally get into play this game uh, as you can see I'm already level 15 I've been based I, I've been banging out the multiplayer the multiplayer is just so fun um actually I'm recording this right after the, the 24 hour stream that I just did um, along with Splat TV. And um, today we're actually going to be playing through, well, this whole series is going to be me playing through the single player because I have not touched it yet. Um, look at this person here. All right, so um, let's go ahead because I have, I, I'm, I can't wait to play the single player. So many people have been saying that the single player is just ex extremely fun. Uh, the final boss is incredible and all that type of stuff. And, but yeah, here we go. Let's see. Oh gosh, look at me. Well, I have to buy clothes. <laughs> well, got Captain Cuttlefish here. The, 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 Okay. The Octarians are coming. Ah! I'm sorry, I lost my cool for a moment there. I'm Captain Cuttlefish, leader of the legendary Squidbe Squidbeak Splatoon. That look in your eyes. I've, sp I've been waiting for a young, unlike you. The great Zapperfish that powers Inkopolis has vanished. And though nobody will believe me, it's the work of the Octarians. They're after, they're after revenge for their defeat in the war 100 years ago. That was 100 years ago, can't they go over it? I was keeping a watchful eye on them myself, of course. You need a life. But they stole the great Zapperfish. This is a Zapper from right under my nose you don't have a nose what are you talking about please you must help me recover the great zapfish i'll take your science to mean yeah because you, you're as weird as i uh, okay what okay all of a sudden I'm, i got some gear now okay so yeah you guys have probably heard of this before i mean from other videos um, unless, well, if you've seen a spoiler video of just showing the first thing, I mean, I've seen it before from, um, Game Explain. Anyway, here we go. So, uh, we can, you know, do some stuff. I use motion controls when I play Splatoon because that is just the most, that's the ideal way of playing. So, anyway, here we go. Um, what is this? How do I get into it? Oh, <laughs> I have to shoot it first. I didn't know that. Okay, cool. Level one. So, I'm thinking I'm going to break, um, these parts into, like, three, three levels. Um, because it's... Well, it's just, I think it'll be enough. I mean, like, I, I can only record for so long, right? All right. Anyway, these people are easy to, to take out. All right. Well, take that guy out, get this box. I'm going to collect as many um, of those orange uh, balls as much as I possibly can because, um, well, it's obvious because those things are, they can really help in single player, basically. Um, and I kind of really already know how, I'm, how to play this game. Well, of course, because I've spent like, I put like 15 hours into the multiplayer, so this is just really, this is really, really nothing, isn't it? This is really nothing, that's what I'm trying to say. Alright, but anyway, um, here we go, get these orange egg things, and then we'll take on these enemies. The Octarians, here we are. There we go. Easy. Next. Here we go. To the next platform. Uh, this game does play a lot like, uh, well, the single player campaign does. The, this game plays a lot like uh, Super Mario Galaxy from like how you um, have to jump and all that type of stuff. Or you jump from platform to platform, right? But yeah, but I kind of love, I kind of like that um, aspect of it because Super Mario Galaxy, or well, yeah, Super Mario Galaxy 1 and 2 were one of my favorite Wii games. So um, throw that there. I'm distracted. I'll just kill that guy off. Where did the thing go? Oh, it's over there. Oh, can I go up here, please? Thank you. Oh, oh, <laughs> I can't get up. All right, cool. All right, awesome. All right, skip over that. All right, shoot this thing up. Shoot this thing up. Throw that grenade. Um, oh, wait. Oh, gosh, what's that? Okay, so I only know... Um, if you go up here, because I already know this because I saw a video and it's, well, it kind of spoiled it for me. Um, there's actually a secret skull there, so I might as well get it because I know it's here. And um, I don't really plan to go back to this. I don't plan to go back to level one, right? All right, so I'm gonna shoot that. Go over here. Wow. Oh, can I get up there though? <laughs> there we go. All right, cool. There we go. Got the scroll. Let's go down here. Next part. Next part. 
Awesome. Right. Shoot this thing up. Alright. Kill this enemy. Alright, so we need to find a key. And I don't know where this could be. It's probably hiding in one of these um, Octarians. So, might as well just... Might as well get it as well. Oh, there it is. Right there. It's on the top there. Top of the platform. Throw a grenade. Probably kill them both, right? Yep. Nope. Can I kill you? Thank you. Alright. Awesome. Alright. Gonna go to... Oh, I'm gonna bring this key back to this area. Whoop, that jump though. <laughs> Alright. Next area. And that fish is right there. Awesome. Alright. Final checkpoint. Here we go. I uh, just need to find one key, so that's alright. Oh. Grenade. Look at that grenade. Well then. Alright. Go up here. Uh, there's boxes here. There's probably some... Oh, there's... <laughs> the key's right here. That's alright. Alright. Okay, so... Okay, we need to bring that key over there. So... Oh. Okay, they're spawning in. The goons! Damn it! <laughs> alright, cool. Thank you. Let me go through. I feel like I missed one egg. Oh, wait. I could have gotten 100. I, I'm, I think there's 100 in here. Oh, wait. There's a... I'm, you know what? Never mind. I was looking for, like, at least one more, um, one of those ink egg things, those orange, um, circular things. But, of course, I couldn't find it. So, it doesn't matter. I mean, I wanted to get, I wanted to cap it off at 100, but, you know, it doesn't matter. Anyways, got the first Zapfish. Level 1 is completed. We never have to go back to here ever again, unless we want to do it for fun. Okay, so since we got a scroll, since the time of immemorial, a rare type of electric catfish known as the Zapfish has been prized by Inkling society as a source of energy. In fact, the entire city of Inkopolis is powered by a single 100-year old great Zapfish, and that's the thing that we're trying to look for. Alright, awesome. Okay. That's easy. Oh, wait. Can we power up stuff? Alright, let's check that. Uh, power up. Okay, so... Okay, we're nowhere near that. <laughs> Um, okay, we can't power up anything, so we might as well just, um, might as well go to level 2. There we go. Is this level 2? Yep, this is definitely level 2. Alright. So I'm gonna do at least two levels, or three levels. Two or three? Actually, maybe four. Maybe four. I don't even know. Depends how I feel. <laughs> it does also depend, like, how fast we get through this, right? So, um, just go up here. We've been playing for this for, like, eight minutes now, so... Oh gosh. Give me them eggs. <laughs> Alright, gonna go up here. But I do love this game. I mean, this game is... It's everything that I expected it to be. I mean, it's definitely... It's online multiplayer. That's one good good thing. I mean, I love things that do, like... That's online and it's multiplayer. And you can play with your friends and all that type of stuff. And, of course, another thing that is just so fun. And the sound font is just so satisfying. Like, all that type of stuff. Alright, but anyway, um... I think we cleared out that area, so let's go down here. Oh gosh, there's only one. There we go. I haven't seen any power-ups yet, so this is, that's an interesting thing to note. All right. One thing I can't wait for the multiplayer though. Um, while we're going through single player, let's talk about multiplayer. Um, rank battles is one thing I can't wait for because um, if you guys didn't know, I am actually a part of a. Of course, a squid squad team because I just wanted, I need, I wanted to, innit? I, I wanted to. Um, I'm part of a Splatoon team known as Squid Squad, um, Squid Squad EU. Um, and I plan to play competitively with um, these people. I mean, it's a nice group of people right there. Um, especially, oh, what am I going with this? Especially nothing. I, I don't even know what I was trying to say there. All right, cool. All right, let's go up here. Oh, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> All right, there we go. Awesome. All right. Oh. Can we kill you, please? Thank you. Oh, that's... Those things can't be killed. Give me that. <laughs> All right. Oh. Go up there. Wait, no. Let's get, all this, let's get all this stuff first. All right. Oh, I can shoot that, can't I? Let's go up here. Uh, yep, range. I got that range. Awesome. Hey, that jump. <laughs> Alright. Wait, we can shoot that. Give me the eggs. Alright. Oh, I shot something, didn't I? No, I didn't. Alright, never mind. Checkpoint. Awesome. Alright. What is this here? We are landing on this thing. Oh, gosh. 
I messed up my camera by doing my by lifting my aimer up there like that. Oh. Alright, cool. Awesome. Next area. Wait, didn't we I should have checked I should have checked that area a little bit more because I don't know if I'm missing any scrolls or anything like that. But if I was if I was to look for the scrolls, I'll look for it in my own time. And I might make a video of where all the scrolls are anyway, so. Um yeah, so stay tuned for that, you know. Anyway, I think this is a part where we get to go on to the, yeah, this thing. This is the, this is the ink cannon. It's all right. So ink cannon, let me go on to this thing. Oh, gosh. I like how you have to aim using the motion controls with this part to be really accurate, which is nice. All right. I think that's, that's enough, isn't it? Come on, man. Okay. No, oh, damn it. <laughs> Oh, I can't make it. All right. Okay, let's do this a little bit. All right. There we go. Thank you. I should be able to make this. Oh. Jump, jump, jump. There we go. No, it's not enough. Oh. There we go. That worked. That works. There we go. Awesome. Give me that zapfish. Yes. <laughs> All right. Level two completed. Easy enough. Okay. Uh, let's go over here. Oh, can I walk over here? Right. So let's see what's in here. This is another level. This is level three. Rise of the Oct Octocoppers? Interesting. All right. All right. Level three. Easy enough to get through. Uh, let's go. All right. Let's get those um, eggs in there. Because we want to power up our... Um, I'll gun as much as possible because I think if you power up your hero shot, it's not called a splatter shot in the campaign, it's called a hero shot. But um, if you power it, well, if you upgrade it enough, you can have like some rap, you can have rapid fire and all that type of stuff. So it's, it's a really cool mechanism or oh, weapon. All right. Oh, let's go up here. Give me that. Oh, next thing. Jump high. Oh, wait, I pressed the wrong button for that. <laughs> I pressed, uh, what was that? What did I press? I pressed the A button, unfortunately. I was supposed to press the X button because uh, when you're on those zip line things, you can um, you can do some incredible stuff. Anyway, we've got an Ink Zooka. Now, personally, I don't really like the Ink Zooka, even though I just destroyed everything with it right there. But in multiplayer, I, I don't really like it that much. Uh, I find it's just kind of awkward, and I don't like how it's got, like, it's got recoil on it. It's like when you shoot it, you go, you kind of push backwards. So, it's a weapon I don't really like. But anyway, if any of you guys have really got Splatoon, oh, there's a scroll there. Might as well get that. But anyway, if you got any of you guys got Splatoon yet, what's your favorite weapon in the multiplayer? I mean, my so far my favorite weapon is the Jet Squelcher, which is interesting because it's a really hard weapon to use. But I just love how, like, I love the way the, the, the way you have to play with it. You know, it's just. Anyways. All right. All right. We go over here. Let's skip to this part. I'm doing this quite fast because, oh, well, I'm of course I'm experienced. <laughs> I played I've, been, I've played this game for like 15 hours already, and I played the. Oh gosh, <laughs> that was dangerous. <laughs> um, I played the what do you call it? Well, of course I played the. Well, I played three of the global test fires, so um, yeah, something, something to note. All right. Oh. Well, oh, give me that power up. Give me that bomb. Unlucky. Die. <laughs> go. Oh gosh, that failed. All right. Ah, come on, give me, give me up here. All right, there we go. Skip to here. Thank you. Ah, oh, there we go. Awesome. Okay. We did three levels. All right, so I feel like that may be enough, unless the boss is like the next level. But um, let me check. If the boss is if the boss is the next level, I'll play it now. But if it's not, um, I'll just um, what is it? I'll just um stop playing. But anyway, this appears to be a machine designed by for the Octarians to ride, but there is nothing inside. The big question then: How does it move? Perhaps is. Oh my god, I can't speak. Perhaps the Octarians are able to power it through the hard work and willpower alone. K. K. Oh, wait, is it the boss now? Alright. Is that vicious about? Oh, this must be the boss. Alright, so we might as well play this now. We'll, we'll do this now, why not? 
All right. I mean, considering we've fin we've done everything now, so um, this is gonna be. We've done this all this 15 minutes, so this is really good. All right. Something about this is the cube boss, so this is gonna be interesting. All right. Oh my God, is that fish? <laughs> Oh man, well then. You'd expect the thing to die from that, but I guess not. Oh man, okay. Uh, what do I do? Okay, that works. Go up here. I have to shoot the tentacles. Or tentacles. <laughs> I said tentacles. Dude, super jumped off that. Awesome. Alright. So I'm guessing we all we need to do is just dodge his attack and then... Um, be good. <laughs> oh gosh. Alright. Uh I'll just walk over here. Oh, well then. Uh Okay. It's a different pattern every time. Oh, let me get up there. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. Let me shoot this tentacle first. There we go. Alright, cool. This first boss is very easy to do, so it's it's not really it's not like the hardest boss in the world. I mean, all you need to do is just Basically, shoot those things and everything will be good. Oh gosh. Alright. Shoot over here. Boom! Boom! Alright. Uh, let me shoot that. Go up there. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not done. Thank you. Alright, let me get off you. Awesome. Alright, that was an easy boss. Pulled it off. Look at those, look at those legs twist. Look at him leg twist. <laughs> All right, and we get everything gets splattered in our ink. Awesome. So let me just take all of this stuff. There we go. Uh, take that scroll as well. And uh, yeah, that's everything completed. Not bad. Let me get that zap fish. Awesome. So that was the first boss of Splatoon. It's a cool boss. I love how. The, well, I love the design of it. Definitely. It's a, it's a good first boss. Alas, to think they have even have the great Octarians on their side. At any rate, excellent work, Agent 3. Keep it up. It's still a long re- Oh, it's long read. It's a still a long road to the great Zapfish. Alright, awesome. Okay, so I think that's going to wrap it up for this uh, episode. We got a secret skull, or sacred skull. Um, that's just saying some mess. We don't really need to read that. Anyway, um... It's gonna show the oh why are there plugs there? I mean that's that's really dangerous. That's a health that's a health hazard. <laughs> like see right there. That's a health hazard. But anyway, um we have unlocked the next world. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please like, favorite, comment, and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. Follow me on Twitter and Twitch, both in the description below. Do it for both if you're feeling generous. I'm going to be streaming Splatoon very, very often. Just saying that. So um, make sure you follow my Twitch so you'll be able to see that. And my Twitter so you'll know when I'm about to stream. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed and I shall see you guys in a future video.